fibronectin therefore, it is a glycoprotein physiological product of the cervical secretion, high concentration at term, but if it is present in the cervix in a preterm situation, it indicates the risk of delivery. It is absent normally between 23 and 35 weeks of gestation. It is a tool for evaluation of symptomatic women, high negative predictive value 99 percent for predicting preterm labor within 7 days. What does that mean? A negative fibronectin will tell us that the woman is not going to deliver within 7 days. What way it will benefit our practice? Unnecessary corticosteroid administration, admission, counseling can be avoided and judicious use of healthcare resources will be ensured. What is the role of circlage in prevention of preterm labor? We often wonder whether this small surgical procedure will help in prevention of preterm labor. There is a study which suggests that recurrent preterm birth can be prevented uh, in a subset of women only who have a history of prior preterm births. There was a work by Owen and co-workers who randomly assigned 302 women with prior preterm labor with a short cervix of less than 2.5 centimeter to circlage or no procedure. Women with a cervical length of 1.5 milli 15 millimeter actually delivered before 35 weeks significantly less often following circlage compared with women with no circlage. 30 versus 65 percent which is significantly uh, benefiting the woman. Physiological effects of progesterone that inhibit labor, it inhibits oxytocin activation of myometrium. How exactly does the progesterone help in abolition of contraction is that it inhibits oxytocin activation of myometrium, it directly inhibits the prostaglandin production.